Hello everyone, my name is Nomis and welcome to RimWorld. We are picking this game back up again because I want to try a new challenge. I want to try a new series. I want to try a Naked and Afraid. Let's go ahead and set up a new game here, guys. RimWorld. What a game. Okay, so uh, the last couple times we've played this on the channel, I think we've just done the crash landed scenario, just the basic scenario. But this time I want to try the Naked Brutality. You went under anesthetic for minor surgery, now you've awoken in a drop pod crashing into a distant planet. You're naked, alone, and totally underprepared. Can you survive? Warning, this is nothing fair about the scenario. It is extremely difficult and death can happen for any reason. Your faction will be a new arrival. Start with one people chosen from eight. Player starting character has 100% chance to start naked. Sounds like a fun time. And for this, we're gonna go Randy Random. And we're going to strive to survive. Uh, I'm not going all the way <laughs> crazy mode, but um, this will be a challenge for me for sure. Because uh, by no means am I a, uh, a RimWorld expert, but uh, uh, I, I do have a fair share of experience in RimWorld. So let's see what happens here with a, a Naked and Afraid. And we've got to pick a commitment mode. We will commit to uh, not reloading any time, only when we quit and we'll save. And let's just randomize our seed here to Rin. That sounds good. Overall rainfall. Let's make it maybe a little bit rainier. Uh, yeah, let's go with that. Overall temperature. Let's go maybe a little bit colder. Cold rain. And normal population. Sure, let's generate this world. And there we go. There's our world. The Goose Nishida up north. A great name. Amala Mountains. Well, you know what? I kind of like the mountains. I do like to dig. So let's see what we can find here. Something along a road, perhaps? How about this location right here? Boreal forest. Large hills. Average temperature is minus five. That's pretty chilly. Growing period is April, May to September. Average disease frequency, one per year. You know what? Let's give this a shot. It's going to be cold. We're going to be naked. It's going to be a tough start. And let's choose who our character is going to be. Eduardo Burnworth. Mining. Medical. Intellectual. Incapable of violence. That might not be the best... Uh, Best trait to have if we're by ourselves. We would definitely want to be able to hunt. So let's randomize here. Let's go a maximum of five randoms. Uh, Ludmilla Fisher. Wake up addiction 31%. Whole body. Good with animals, medical, cooking, plants. Great memory and industrious. 35% work speed. What does this wake up addiction do? Uh, withdrawal symptoms will begin, however, extended abstinence will force the brain to adapt back to normal state, resolving the addiction. I don't hate this one. Zero shooting in melee, though. Hmm, maybe I don't love her. She's a jungle kid, but let's try one more. Random number three. Incapable of violence again. I'm sorry, we need someone who is incapable of caring. Grandma Alexis? A good miner. She's got some melee skill. She's trigger happy. She's nimble. She's ugly. Trigger happy. Aiming time, minus 50%. Shooting accuracy, minus 5. Old gunshot rune to the right leg. Let's try our last one here. Okay. No incapabilities. This is Gordon Berry. This might be our guy. Mining, very low. Medical is high. Social. Fairly high. Quick sleeper, doesn't need much sleep. Okay, slow poke. Quite slow, but he's tough. All right, this is our guy, Gordon Berry. I don't wanna continuously go through randomized characters for the sake of time. Let's start up with Gordon. It was supposed to be a minor surgery, just an hour under aesthetic. You felt totally safe. Now you've awoken inside a drop pod, punching through the atmosphere of a distant worm world. Aside from a sick, a slick of mysterious goo all over your body, you are totally naked. 
With no preparation, no supplies, and no tools, can you survive? Oh, let's see. Can we survive? What do we have around us? We got some... What is this? Marshland? We lack a, a warm clothes. We lack a weapon. This might not be a bad spot right here to, uh, to set up. Or maybe even over here. Up in here? That might be the best spot. Maybe we'll go up there. Okay. Let's see. We got nothing. We got nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay. Um, let's go. Zone. Let's stockpile. Here. Okay. Let's start chopping some trees. Your way up there, Barry. Barry Gordon. Mr. Gordon. We'll make ourselves a little hut up here. Let's fast forward a little bit. Uh, while he's actually cutting down, let's go to our walls. Oh, we can't until we have some wood. Okay, well, let's just get him chopping down some trees then. And what do we have for food over here? We got some wild heel root. Is there any berries? There are some berry bushes, okay. So let's chop wood and then we'll get some berry bushes. All right, let's harvest these. After he's done with that. Uh, not much else. Okay, we got a couple up here. Might be enough berries to get us through a day or so. We can now start putting up our walls. We shall make our house. Right here. This will be our hut. This is where his adventure begins. Berry, berry, berry. Let's go down to our work. We'll prioritize. So doctor first, firefighting, of course. Patient, bed rest, basic. Okay, those can go first. And what else we want him to focus on? Yes, plant cutting. And then construction. Get these trees chopped down. And then we're going to also want to build a bed. We could just start with the sleeping spot in case we can't build a bed. Throw that down. And then we'll also throw a bed over there. Where'd he go? What, what's he doing? He's off enjoying some free time. Nope, he's getting some berries, okay. That works as well. Okay, so work, let's haul. That's gonna be very important. Okay, got some food. Excellent. We're gonna need to chop down some more trees though. We do not have enough lumber here to finish this little hut. And night is fast approaching. Feels like 19 degrees outside, so that's good. At least we won't be freezing tonight. Dropping down to 16 degrees. We're unhappy with our nudity. One thing at a time here. Okay, so while you're sleeping... Let's see here. Production. Do a crafting spot for crafting simple items like knives or bows. Okay, well, I think we want that. Let's do a crafting spot outside. Oh, no penalty outside. Okay, never mind. Let's put that inside. Crafting spot right there. And that's good. Uh, what else are we going to absolutely need right away? 
Research bench, uh, electric tailor, hand tailor. Should probably build this. Let's put that right. Actually, we're gonna put that over here once we get rid of the sleeping spot. All right. You want? Know you might have enough wood here to finish this up. And I'm gonna put. A what? Maybe I'll do it. Hold on, slow down here a little bit, here, Barry. Furniture shelf. Let's put a shelf there. We can store our food on that. We got the bed. Let's get rid of that. Let's build our hand tailor bench. Let's put him, give him a stool. Give him a stool at the crafting spot as well. Alright, getting the roof on. Let's cut down some more trees. Yeah, have a, a meal of berries there, Barry. The food of choice for our protagonist, our naked protagonist. Let's go gather some more berries. How long do the berries last? 13 days. Okay, so we can actually gather some more. Right, let's harvest all those. Don't see a lot. We got a squirrel up there. Um, this need just wood. Okay, let's focus on getting these first things built. Do this harvesting. All that back. Okay, clean stuff up, Barry. Good job. That's enough for a couple meals there. And we'll have a couple more from these here. Alright, can I make this a priority? Cannot prioritize. Uh, let's build a roof zone above our meager supply area. Just so this stuff doesn't spoil quite so quickly. Or degrade quite so quickly. And actually we will now change that to um, storage. All right, so we want food on here. Don't allow rotten. Actually, can we clear all? Clear all, okay, just food. Don't allow rotten. Uh, a shaman merchant. Okay. Priority critical. A uh, caravan from the red cat Camisa is approaching. They are a shaman merchant. They will hang around the colony for some time before leaving. You can attack them, but this will anger the faction. Well, we have nothing really to trade at this stage, aside from wood. There we go. It's inside. Spoils in 14 days. All right, where's our schedule? So he does not need as much sleep, so we're going to say you get up at 3 a.m. You work for four hours. You take a break. You work for another three hours. You can take a break. Work for another four hours. Take a break. 
And then we'll work through till. Here, let's put one of these as recreation. There you go. Yeah, some recreation time. Actually, you know what? Let's do a meditation in there as well. Recreation, then meditation. All right, I think we should also put a torch inside. That will be good. And we will need to harvest some more trees. I hear a duck. Oh, they're starting to fight. Goose and gobe. Right, have your morning berries. Start chopping. Yeah, I don't think it's worth uh, talking to them. We got absolutely nothing to give. All right, chop away. Let's get a little stockpile of wood going here. Need defenses, lack of weapon, lack of clothing, need meditation spot, need meal source. Uh, let's see, recreation. Where do we go for meditation? Miscellaneous? Party spot and meditation spot, okay. Here, you can meditate over here. In front of that tree. A group of travelers. Passing by. Uh, let's set up a horseshoe for some recreation. Let's put a floor in here as well. Let's keep chopping trees. Halfway to the next level for plants. Keep chopping and you'll get better and better. Okay, we are low on food. Uh, we need to find more food. Here, let's... Let's build a club. Or a knife. Let's do a knife. I'm about to do some hunting. Uh, I gotta look for more berries. More berry bushes. Ooh, I'm not seeing much out here. Anything down here? Gotta be some berry bushes around here. It's a bit of a trek, but we need the food. Can I on Barry? All right, well, this will be enough for uh, a few meals. Oh, and a wanderer has joined us. An archer. This is perfect. Wants to join the colony. Taiki is willing to contribute, but will not leave voluntarily. Claiming to have nowhere else to go, you can choose to turn him down and send him away. However, your colonists will be disturbed at sending someone away in need. And we will accept him. Nice. Okay. We have an archer. With a pistol. Well, I guess you're going to be our hunter then, man. Welcome to the colony. All right, our basics. Um, here we go. Okay. Uh, we're going to need a bigger hut. We need to expand already, or we make him his own hut. Let's make him his own hut. 
We got a little bit of wood here. Just something basic. Alright, let's give him a bed as well. Excellent. Okay, let's go. We need to send him out hunting. There's a rabbit there. Let's go hunt that. Uh, we'll need a butcher table. Production butcher table. Okay, let's go toss this right there. Okay, let's chop down some more trees. Slowly start pushing back the forest. Uh, one colonist idle. Okay. Um, did you get the uh, rabbit? Did you guys just eat that raw? Okay, what can we get him doing? Planet cutting if there's something else to do. Construction if there's nothing else to do. Definitely be cleaning. Schedule. Actually, let's do your recreation time together. We got compact machinery around here. Don't see any iron. Oh, is that silver? Hmm. Uranium. There's a little compact steel. Here. Wow, we did not get a good uh, location for that. Oh, there's some down here too. Okay, let's start mining some of this. When we're able to. Uh, bedroom's almost done. Oh, we can extract tree? That's cool. Replant that. Okay, I know we don't have anything to make stuff out of yet, but... Let's just make some pants. Put that on our bill of things to do. Butcher, forever. Uh, I'm gonna take you off hunting. Ow, oh, neither of you are good cooks. All right, you can mine. Barry will have enough to do here. Any more animals to hunt. Not going after that guy. Oh, there's that rabbit. Can we not get to that? Oh, major break risk. Oh no, Barry. What's going on? Take ye openly insulted Barry's nephew's diet. What an asshole. All right, what do you need? It's uncomfortable, ravenously hungry, tired. 
Okay, let's adjust the schedule here. So it is, what, 2 a.m.? Uh, you should be sleeping, man. Why don't you go back to, back to bed? Consuming berries, yes, go consume some berries, Barry. Permanent winter. That doesn't sound good. Four degrees outside, yeah, I guess it would be chilly being that naked. Well, I can grab it. I don't know why T he didn't grab it before. Need a meal source, I know. Need to find some more stuff to hunt. Oh, I saw some deer down here, yeah. All right, come on. Get us some food. Uh, I want you to hunt instead of mine. Does he not have... I thought he had a... Um, pistol. Why is he choosing to do this and not hunt? Maybe he had already started that before we had selected the deer. Dude. You were not out very long, man. Oh, you were not out very long at all. Are there any more berries out here? Fox. All right, hunt. Hunt. I am not seeing any berries. This is a uh, horrible forest for food. Berry collapsed. Due to extreme exhaustion. Why aren't you sleeping, Barry? Alright, can you... Can I, can I force you to sleep? No. Why is Barry not sleeping? Just because it's not his time to sleep? Uh, since it looks like you'll be here for a while, T, he thinks that you should give your faction a name. What should your faction be called? Sounds good to me. South Arinium of Growth's Forest. Uh, let's change this name. Heneron Coalition. Rabaron. Yeah, the Rabarons of Growth Forest. Sounds good. Come on, bring home some food. Hunt all the small animals. He's got very high shooting. He just does not have a good weapon. So maybe we should craft a bow for him. Maybe that would work better. some light leather and we have a raid they're attacking immediately all right our first our first raid let's get ready here uh barry you don't have any weapon do you Can you craft something quickly? Quickly make a knife. <laughs> Tiki. You cover. Always oh, going around this way.
Craft away, Barry. Take the shot. Nice, nice shot. Uh, where's the health? All right, shot the torso. In the leg. The right index finger. There we go. Good job. Got some jade. We have a bow. I think we should keep the pistol. He actually did fairly well there. Um, we have some clothes. I mean, Barry's not going to be happy wearing dead man's clothes, but he's got some clothes and now he has a knife. An awful steel knife. All right, Barry. Wear that. You can come back for your berries after. Okay, so we have 25 light leather. How much does this take? 40 ingredients. Okay, so we need a little bit more. And I guess we should probably build a grave. Um, yeah, let's do our graveyard maybe down here. All right, we're not naked anymore. They'll need a, bar a bed mark for colonists' use. Also make sure they're not drafted. They aren't. Do I have to change the schedule up maybe? So it's 9 p.m. Berry. Sleep. It says he's... He needed less sleep, right? Or am I thinking of someone else? Quick sleeper. We'll rest in about two-thirds the usual time. Alright, well, he can wake up a little bit earlier then. And he's got, what does he carry in here? Like a raccoon. Yeah, major break risk, I know. Get inside, man. Get to sleep. Oh man, another raid. Attack immediately. Club. Uh, Tiki, are you sleeping down here? No, you're sleeping at base. Okay, wake up. Take cover. It's gonna take him a while to get around. Barry should have enough time. Oh, yeah. You know what? Let's move up here. Might be able to get some good shots while he's slowed down by the marsh. See how he approaches. Uh, Barry collapsed. Okay, Barry, just go to bed. TQ will protect us. Line of shot. Slow him down. Okay, fall back, fall back, fall back. Barry, I may need you up. I think I need Barry up. Let's 
Stab him. Stab house in the gut. Okay, we're good. Let's save that medicine for when we really need it. Alright, we've survived the first two attacks. Barry, you need more sleep, man. Um, 1 a.m. I just want to get Barry to sleep. God, Barry. Can I not force you to go to sleep? food okay sleep good okay that should help him getting some rest mood is going up slowly it's recreation starved well you could be playing some horseshoes let's give him some more recreation time here actually do that overlap we'll be tweaking the uh, schedules quite a bit Maybe we should strip this guy down too and I'm gonna have to cut more trees I need to build like a kitchen. All right, let's do a kitchen over here. Just big enough. That might be too small, but. Burning stove. All right. Fueled stove. And we'll put some floor in there too. He's mining. Okay. Um, I'm going to cancel these ones. That'll be enough steel for now. Uh, let's start a farm. Should have started this earlier. Road zone. some rice uh, growing yeah I want you to grow you're gonna be our food producer you can be hunting and growing crops Without a table, okay, we can make you a table. We can do tables. Three by three table, two by four. They have smaller ones, one by two. They have like a one by one. All right, table for you. Pretty, but the work. Yeah, 
Yeah, it's so hungry. Um, I'll look for more stuff to hunt. Here, are animals. Uh, wildlife, that's what I want. Alright, let's hunt some squirrel. Some more storage room here. Expand that out. Expand our roof area. Uh, I can't build over a poplar tree. Well, let's chop that down. All right, Barry's mood slightly higher. T Tiki's is slightly lower. Major break risk. Okay, I'm gonna give you more sleep time as well. Yeah, just go to bed. Sleeping outdoors. Which is not helping. Oh, and we're starving. Fantastic. I mean, we got corpses here, but I'd rather not. <laughs> I would rather not. We got a rabbit to butcher. There'll be some food in the morning. Wish there was more berry bushes. Not seeing any, though. Yeah, let's try and hunt a deer, too. That'll be a decent amount of food if we can get that. Alright, some race is pl planted. Working on the kitchen. Some prepared meals would be better than the raw ingredients. What a struggle. Right. Prove that. Such a poor constructor. I mean, Tiki's the better constructor, but I kind of need him hunting. Food man, it's gone rotten. All right, how would you haul that back, or just consume the squirrel? Just do it, man. Yes, go eat it in the water. Wash your hands of the blood. God. What a life. Alright, get us a deer, man. Get that deer. Nice. Good, good, good. Uh, cannot haul. No empty accessible spot. Okay, hold on. We will fix that. Storage. Um, yeah, we'll just allow corpses. That's fine. Let's haul that back. A good hunt. Alright, Barry. I want you to dig those graves so we can get rid of these corpses. Got got some food here. I just need a butcher. Um, let's 
gonna be our cook. I mean, they're you're, you're both horrible. You got level two. Okay. Gary, you're gonna be cooking. You're gonna cobble together some meals. Need to get this thing built. Um, I guess I need more wood, don't I? I right, got 75 meat left from that deer. We got this. No one's had a break yet. Um, we now have enough to make some clothes, so he doesn't have to wear the the crummy clothes. Mood slightly going up for Barry. Tiki. Hungry, ate a corpse, yeah, not the best. 15 hours, slept in the cold, that'll be fixed soon. Should to get Barry back to work. All right, keep planting. All right, Barry getting a good meditation in. Doing wonders. For his morale. We definitely have enough leather now to make a set of pants. I need to be cutting plants and uh, constructing. Uh, I need you to be constructing. We need to get this building finished. We got too many projects on the go for them. What else is new? Alright, just keep cutting trees, man. We need more wood. There we go. Okay, your room is built. We got a table. Plant that out here. Oh man, he's so much faster. So many less botched attempts. Yes, dig that grave. Bury that corpse. Do it all, Tiki. Okay, uh, I want to build this. Oh, 80 steel. Okay, we need to go mine more. All right, Tiki's mood is up. Good. Barry's hauling. Another squirrel. All right, the corpses are buried. Just relaxing socially. Uh, let's put another torch in here. Okay, go mine. I hope you're mining. Yes. All right, we'll have a uh, stove here momentarily. Another couple days, maybe, maybe just one day. Run low on food, but we do have some squirrels. Two days before they go rotten on us. Like that one already has rotted away. Yeah, we still need more trees. Okay, let's just go to chop wood. Just clear that out. Keep you busy. Or 
37% grown. Let's do another grow zone. Some more rice. In our spot, kept that heel root. All right, our stove is built. Start cooking some simple meals. Wow, there's a lot of different um, meals now carnivore fine meal, vegetarian fine meal. That's pretty cool. We're just gonna start with simple meals. Uh, we'll do until we have 10 meals. Sure. That sounds good. We are... Yeah, run out of meat here. Alright. Let's do some more hunting. Okay, we got some more stuff here. We got boars. We'll hunt doe, rabbit... Boars. Cook stove is up and running. Uh, zone dumping. Corpses. Rotten. Don't allow rotten. Okay. To get those squirrel corpses out of there. Shame that we wasted so much there. Alright, we have a nice little stockpile of wood now. Is anyone good at crafting? Tiki. Uh, make pants need material. What's this leather called? Various plain leather. Light leather. Oh, we have light leather and plain leather. Okay, two different. I thought those the same. We got a boar. All right, second rice patty has been planted. All right, finish this guy off. I know we're starving. It's about to change though. Okay, I think we should start thinking about a research bench. So let's build an animal flap. A doorway hung with thick overlapping strips of fabric or leather. It allows animals to pass while insulating the temperature. Animal flaps are commonly used as barn doors to give pinned animals shelter place to sleep. Hmm. That's cool. What if I should put a fence around my plants here so animals don't eat it? I think we should. Let's do a gate. Their side there. And we're also going to do a, a research room over here. Okay. 
Okay, production, simple research bench. Our first bit of rain. Start thinking about power soon. Um, let's mine out some compact machinery. Still just eating uh, raw meat, but Barry is cooking his first meals. There we go, we have a meal. Let's put a roof over this. Oh god. Lightning strikes. Ah, uh, we're gonna need more wood. Shopping, Barry. I think we'll keep our meals in here and our raw food on this bench here at the counter. Look at that, we're like 50% happiness. I'll take it. Go through so much wood. All right, storm has passed. Yes, enjoy your meal on your table. We are nine days in. And we have a semblance of a small community. A semblance of civilization. Having started from nothing. Excellent, more food. Okay, I think that's enough food for now. I don't want to waste too much. Get some sleep. I would like to finish the uh, research room here before we end the episode. Got 170 wood. That won't be quite enough. Uh, we need more steel. Okay, so let's mine some more steel down here. That is already selected. Takey. mining All right. focus on mining first colonist needs treatment what happened here asthma oh didn't realize that Birds can pants deteriorate away. That's fine. All right, get that compact machine, but then you need to go get some steel. Group of travelers passing by. Hey there. All right, is there any more heal root out here we can harvest? Should grab some. Slaver from the Red Cat Camisas passing by. A caravan from the Red Cat Camisa is approaching. They are a slaver. They will hang around. Hmm. 
Do we purchase someone else for the colony? Alright, let's, uh... I mean, we still don't have much to trade. So it might be a moot point. Let's get that steel, haul that back. That should be enough to do our research bench now. Keep getting heal roots. Alright, um... Let's change this. Construction primary task now, buddy. And then do some cooking. Actually, Barry, since you're a better cook, you should probably do that. Just taunting us with their pemmican meals. Gotta get this stuff butchered. Uh, donkeys have joined. Look at that. We got some donkeys. Well, I'll be. So, zone. How do we make an animal zone? Animal. Manage area. New area. Oh no, uh, delete that. Uh, invert. How do I do this? Expand allowed area. Area one. Let's keep the donkeys nearby. Okay, animals, okay, area one, not in a pen, how do I set this to uh, animals, I have to figure out how to make a, make a pen with the fences I guess and then uh, move the animals up. Oh man, they're, they're already getting busy. Jeez. Yeah, baby donkeys here soon. At least a wild. Anyway, I'm gonna have to do some research into that, figure that out. Elsewhere, we are finishing up our research bench. And I will set some tasks on the research bench for us to look into. That will do it for our introductory episode to our Naked and Alone series in RimWorld. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you'd like to see some more, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe if you're new to the channel so you get those wonderful notifications of when those episodes are going up. We've also got a couple other series uh, going on the channel right now. Uh, one of them being Seven Days to Die and another soon to be a new Project Zomboid series. So if any of those games sound interesting to you, make sure you subscribe, make sure you hang around. And we also stream over on Twitch, twitch.tv slash plays. Check us out there. Come say hi. Uh, we'll be playing a variety of games over the coming weeks here and we'd love to see you out there. Discord link also in the description if you would like to stay up to date with notifications in that method. Okay, guys, that does it for today. Thanks a lot for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Until next time, I'll talk to you all later.